Hi everyone, it's Ajahn Kampli. Well, today is one prak, or what we call a uh, Buddhist holy day. It's very different from, from the Chinese of 1st and the 15th lunar. Okay? Uh, in Thailand, they go by one prak, which is uh, sometimes in a month, you have four or five times. You must have the Thai uh, calendar to be able to know. Uh. Uh, in Thailand, one prak is considered an important day. Okay? Some people actually uh, take off work and they will go into temples yeah? to, to, to fulfill their duties. Yeah? Yeah, to fulfill their duties like uh, meditation, chanting, or basically they are uh, self-cultivating, okay? doing wholesome activities on one prak day. Okay? So those of you who are familiar or comes and visit me often, yeah? you realize that on one prak, I seldom uh, take in cases uh, or, or do any reading for anyone uh, for a simple reason yeah uh, during one prank day I will usually be tired with activities of uh, doing all this uh, if you can see here yeah if you can see here there are uh, all this can okay um, well I have a photo you can actually see yeah this in the video okay so uh, there'll be a lot of a lot of things all these are hand Hand work, yeah, okay, and um, I remember in one of my earlier videos, uh, I did tell you all that I will give you a brief explanation of what Kanha is all about. And today is one prank, yeah. Uh, I think what's more better than today, yeah, since yeah, uh, I'm really starting up on it, okay. Now, what is one prank? Basically, uh, what is Kanha? Kanha. Uh, in English, yeah, in Buddhist Buddhist terms, uh, they call it the five aggregates. I'm sure some of you would have really known. Okay, uh, basically, it is it is five of these cones. Okay, uh, these cones. Okay, uh, which basically it, it contains a pair of joysticks, a pair of candles, whether it's white or yellow, it's fine and a pair of flowers it has to be auspicious flowers yeah so basically that's that's the basic that you will need to okay and the rest like you see i also have the uh sire pinang in it okay and uh, uh and secrets okay so this because a lot of my crew uh some of them are lay people okay and some of them are roshis okay so actually uh, that, that's additional that we basically it's an offering for crew okay we put it in kanha and kanha basically it's you yeah like i always say it's, it's like us surrendering ourselves in totality into something that you had faith with for example this is uh, buddhism surrendering ourselves taking refuge in buddha dharma and sangha so just let me uh, briefly let you know okay uh, what is kanha okay like i've said kanha is you uh, I, will, I will just do a little bit of explanation okay basically it's rup vetana sanya sankan vinyan okay let me let me explain it in plain english yeah basically rup means your form okay we have got a form right yeah uh, the one head legs and all that yeah Vetana basically it's feelings, yeah, feelings. We we are humans, so we, we must have feeling. We have form and we have feelings. Okay, sanya sanya would be um, you can say consciousness, yeah, consciousness. Okay, uh, sankhan sankhan would be uh, I think some some Buddhist text puts. Put it, put it at uh, volition, volitional activities. But basically, these are mind works or brain works, whereby uh, all the all the uh, channels, yeah, like your eyes, uh, our nose, our ears. Whenever it, it it receives information, it sends informations up to our brain to decipher. Okay, that's sankan, sankan. Okay, uh, and the last one is actually. Vinyan. Okay, last one is Vinyan. What's Vinyan? Vinyan basically, uh, it's you. Okay, yep. Uh, you have you have you have feelings. 
uh, you have um, uh, basically yeah you can say feelings consciousness okay uh, so maybe there, there are there are mixtures of here and there but basically it's about that huh? we, we must have all these five to become uh, a, a complete person or any being for that matter even animals you should have all these five yeah so basically uh, it, it is very much in terms with uh, Buddhism yeah why right, because basically uh, all this that we we are preparing yeah basically you have to prepare with with good faith I always tell people uh, when, when we prepare all this kanku or kanha firstly you have to be clean okay uh, then uh, make sure that in the process of you uh, making them you must you, you must use your tzit okay you must have samati okay you cannot be doing here then you talk bad about people you know about talk about filthy things or unwholesome things and all no it is an activity whereby it needs uh, concentration awareness and good mindfulness okay and you know all these things are natural things okay flowers and all that okay and it shows you that uh, you as a person okay us all these five composition they are never permanent okay uh, it is subjected to decay yeah so it basically means that one day we will we will we won't be around why because we have been decayed okay died yeah so uh, it, it shows a lot of things but you know i'm not going to go through the, the dharma part of it uh, there are a lot of a lot of um a lot of website that talks about it okay i think i've showed you before uh, this is the the simpler form without the without the banana leaves like i've i've, I've mentioned before uh, in my previous uh, videos uh, sometimes in a rush I do just prepare the 10 joysticks 10 candles 10 flowers okay uh, at times I will have 10 uh, sireh and 10 pinang and 10 cigarettes yeah okay so like I, I think some of you have seen this before this is the uh, crew for uh, astrology consultation yeah So basically, it just comes back to, um, comes back to the, the question which I've, uh, I've answered in my previous videos. Some of you said, how do I, how do I uh, make my amulets or, or the Buddhas or the Kuba Ajan that you, you, are, you are praying to or revering to? How, how do you make that strong connection uh, whereby you know you you receive miracles in that sense eh? i believe all of you are looking into that so basically these these are things that we do okay of course it's not that you do it because you 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 want to uh, you you want to strike for the and you know? no 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 it's not yeah? it, it's about it's about uh, sincerely seriously uh, 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 offering something of yourself okay so don't do not simply uh, just do this because uh, you've seen Ajahn Kampli mention it and you say oh I will just do it and all that no yeah uh, even my teachers do 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 remind me say oh uh, don't 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 follow or don't do uh, I'm just telling you this and that yeah why because uh, again like I've said you have to ask people home you you had faith with uh, who's who's who knows all these things or who knows very well okay why because uh, certain things uh, would be dangerous for you or i wouldn't say dangerous or perhaps yeah you can because some some of us do all these things because we uh, we wanted something for example and i always say i want to strike for the or I want to buy a house or I'm in a desperate situation you know, I want help this and that for example and they started to do all these things and at one point in time when they realized that oh no like it's not working you know and they stop okay and it could be where the problem starts okay so do not simply follow just because uh, you heard that I, I talked about uh, you are welcome to send your uh, 
questions over or well, when I'm free you can drop by my center we can always chit chat to know more okay to tell you what can and what cannot be done uh, it's, it's a bit difficult to really address everything you know, in a video yeah I'll just highlight it out I'll give you all some points to ponder and well if you're interested sincere do you want to know more give me a call yeah or make an appointment with me right and then free we can always sit down or you can send me messages right okay that's the end for today see you in the next video clip